If you enjoy looking at a nice, clean Kenworth truck, this is the video for you. Look at this beauty, all shiny and clean. Anyway, we just came back from two weeks vacation in Canada. We left the tractor here at the Creek Terminal in Mechanicsburg, Pennsylvania. Got back last night. Kevin found an empty hooked up to it and this morning gets his load assignment on a loaded trailer here. Uh, it's called a T-Call with Crete. At Werner it used to be called a split. And uh, hey, it's full of beer. He's about to hook up to it. So we're going to talk uh, beer, show you how to inspect uh, for spotted lantern flies, and parting with such sweet sorrow. So stick around. Also, subscribe to the channel if you want to keep traveling with us, learning about trucking, seeing the worlds of America, and just general shenanigans. <laughs> Welcome to the joy of trucking. Buckle up. Let's go. And we want to take this opportunity to thank everybody who has bought us coffees with the link in the description and the pinned comment. We really, really appreciate your support of the channel. And of course, a big thank you as well to everybody who decided that they wanted to drive for Crete and remembered to give them our referral code SLOWKEV. It's a great way to support the channel and we are very grateful and hope you have a fabulous career here. All right, now let's see what Kevin's up to. This is a T-call load, so I'm picking it up at the terminal and taking it up to Syracuse. It's a load of beer. Beer is heavy. This is 43,000 plus, and uh, the load's been scaled. There was a scale ticket with the bill of lading that was in the box on the front of the trailer. And the tandem's already set, so I'm not going to mess with anything. Okay, and uh, did you check for the spotted lantern fly? Because we are in Pennsylvania. Yeah. I will check again for that. Let's Thanks show for people. Reminding me, and honey. let's show people how to check for that. Could you just tell them what to do? Yeah, I'm looking up underneath the trailer to see if any little buggers are hanging there, and check the tires. They like to park on the tires and plant their little eggs on the tires.
ready to go. You're ready to go. Yeah, get in the truck. <laughs> well, actually, we're parting ways. Want to tell them what we've done for the last two weeks? Hey, get in the truck. Let's do it in here. Here's the, here's the, here's stuff on top, because we're just coming off of vacation, actually. So Kevin has his stuff up there, because now he's going to be staying down here. My goodness, you dumped some bag there or something? <laughs> like a wild animal was in there. You have to certify your logs, and I've been on vacation. That's wrong. Just like that, see? You keep doing that for all the days. So, uh... Oh, every day that you were off? You mean? Yeah, but it only goes back a week, so it's only the past week after that. But now I have to show that I've picked up this trailer loaded the lady oh. driver weight considerable four through two ninety Seal number. Right. Four. Hmm. Look, it's a, a hunt. Don't see them very often. Very nice. Nice step deck. Yeah. That's the flat bedding division of Creed Carrier Corporation. Ready to go on the road. Everything's done. Fuel, GPS, loaded call, steering wheel. Damn. Right there. And you Kay. put your lock on the trailer? No, I, I'll be delivering it in a couple hours. I don't think that'll be a problem. I'm not stopping anywhere. All right, and the other guy didn't leave his lock? No. Good. So we were on vacation for the last two weeks. We went up to Canada to see some family and uh, there was a little reunion celebration up there, 50th anniversary, uh, something uh, something I used to do when I was a teenager. Called? Called the 2912 Sudbury Irish Royal Canadian Army Cadet Corps. So shout out. <laughs> shout out to the guys from the Irish. And the ladies. And the ladies, of yeah. course, yes. Yeah, some of whom are now watching the channel, so <laughs> welcome <laughs> okay. aboard. Yeah. Uh, so, uh, two weeks on vacation. Uh, now we're back in the truck. Tanya's going to head down to Florida in the car, and I'll meet her there in a little bit. And uh, 
we just bought a house there so uh, we'll we'll do the closing next week and uh, in the meantime I'm gonna take this beer up to New York <laughs> not for your consumption <laughs> No. okay and how is it being back on the truck after two weeks do you remember everything or do you have a checklist or how it's, does that go it's coming back to me slowly I think this one makes it go fast no this one turns it right yeah yeah this yeah. one makes it go slow I don't know I, I was driving the car for two weeks and I kept reaching for the Jake brake I'm like, what? where is it it's not even there <laughs> so yeah I'm glad to be back in the truck and it looks good because I washed it before I left so I'm very very happy that it's still nice and shiny clean mm -hmm. and then it rained yesterday to rinse off any new dirt like yeah pollen and dust or whatever the dust is gone yeah so kirk shout out to you nice clean nice truck clean truck even had them polish the wheels Ooh. Yeah. okay so you're ready to go I'm we shall say go. our goodbyes and i will see you in florida yeah bye anybody i'll miss you i'll see you in this a week. is challenging turn right then turn left jeez right, one moment yeah <laughs> yeah i do get sad at this when we part ways but i look forward to seeing you again soon very soon. Drive safe. Drive slow. Okay. Bye. <laughs> Me. this video give us a thumbs up and put your comments down below and tell us what you think hit that subscribe button and tinkle the old notification bell how's that <laughs> very nice all right well done you remembered that <laughs> yeah bye hon bye Yeah.